IBM has undertaken a very comprehensive approach to industry solutions in general, and uh, healthcare specifically, what we've done at IBM is to design a, a framework called the Health Integration Framework, which provides solution on-ramps, or solution areas as we call them, for different types of problems. And because of the need for flexibility, scalability for these solutions, we've made it a configuration, a configurable type of environment where you can pick and choose the areas of the framework that you wish to apply to your solution area, problem area. So for the health integration framework, we have uh, looked at the industry, we've looked at the standards, we've uh, looked at business partners that we're, going, that we're working with, and we've brought them to the table and included them in an ecosystem that leverages the best of our technologies as well as our partner technologies and industry standards. We typically look at three areas of healthcare. We look at the provider industry, which are the folks that deliver healthcare to our uh, citizens and consumers and patients. We look at the health payer industry. Those are the folks who provide healthcare insurance, both the, from a government perspective as well as from the private sector. And we look at life sciences and pharma f uh, for those companies that focus on drug discovery and, and development. Each one of those uh, segments of the industry have similar requirements in terms of integration, uh, providing uh, flexible and seamless uh, access to applications, and also integrating data at the back end, as well as integrating the applications uh, on a message uh, standards basis. We have very uh, targeted sorts of solutions for each one of those segments of the industry. From the front end integration perspective, we call uh, health e-views and clinical uh, views, if you will. Uh, we take the best of the industry standard requirements, like hl 7 Sika, for example, and implement our uh, portal technology, providing industry standards, open standards, like JSR 168 and so on, uh, WSRP, which are technology standards that allow for integrating multiple applications in different portlets and be able to share data amongst them. And, and Tony will uh, will go into that more uh, in more detail. That's his uh, expertise area, and um, and that's a very important from a healthcare perspective because that is the face of the enterprise to its customers and users. There are new models of care emerging in the United States and elsewhere in the world, and the technologies that are part of the health integration framework are meant to be the underpinnings and the support structure that allow for sharing information to provide better uh, and more efficient care to our uh, patients and, and citizens. Um, today, uh, you have a very fractured uh, health care system, uh, and no single venue of care has all the information. This provides a, a stage for a, a lot of errors and not the best outcomes. Uh, it is, uh, research has shown that patients uh, don't get the, the right care 50% of the time, don't get the right medications 30% of the time, but if, if that could be uh, changed by transforming how we deliver care by leveraging IT. So, for example, if we made sure that a physician who's discharging an AMI patient has not uh, prescribed uh, a beta blocker or an ACE inhibitor, we provide that alert for that physician, uh, we would have better outcomes for AMI patients. And the same for diabetics as well. We need to have more uh, targeted focus on uh, preventive care. I think the best way that our clients can leverage the solutions uh, from our integr in integration framework is to first understand their problems, to diagnose their own situation and look at where they want to start. And often the problem is that our clients tend to take a big bang approach and that is very risky. So uh, what the framework provides are different starting points, if you will. And uh, depending on the uh, level of maturity that the provider or the payer is at in the point in time, it really helps a customer to look at a 
the value that IT will provide, the use of IT and the solution that we provide uh, will give them. So we offer things like business value assessments, for example, to leverage um, the process that we provide so that you can learn better how to uh, extract the, the value from those solutions. And we do that quite a bit with portals, for example, and Tony is uh, our expert in that area. And we, we do that for a lot of these other solutions. So the, the client needs to look at, from an analytical perspective, what, what are the day-to-day -day problems I'm dealing with? Where do I want to go? Have a roadmap for that. Do I have a good architecture and a foundation to build on that, something that has a flexibility, scale, and is built for the future rather than just tomorrow and good enough?